Is he going to jump up here? Let me get my bow. I don't want him shooting or uh, screaming. Dude, what a freaking face. I got him right in the mouth. Hey, welcome back everybody. The Accidental Survivor here, and we're back with another episode of Scum. And I made it back to my base. I've done a little bit of work. You see I got some walls going up. I got a door. I even got a lock on the door, even though you can run around it. Um, still working on uh, the platform, expanding it a little bit. It's probably going to be, this probably be as about as far as it goes. And then I'll have stairs going up to a second floor. Make like a tower, almost like a tower. Um, I still got to upgrade all this, but it's so much freaking work to build a base in this game. It's almost like pointless. That's why I usually just find a house. And then board up the windows because, you know, like I upgraded this platform. It's already freaking half of the health gone. I don't have any toolkits. All my toolkits are gone or used up. Um, and No, I don't have any in the boat. Um, so I can't do repairs for the base right now. But we are working on it. It is it's coming along. It'll hopefully look better unless the game wipes, like I said. Uh, in the meantime, I've got my inventory cleared out. Uh, I got a wooden stick here still. Let's see if I can put that uh, in my chest. I just don't want... I hate wasting this stuff because uh, the trees that I cut I cut up will grow back. But in the meantime, we'll just get that stick over here and get it out of my inventory. Uh, we've got food. We've got water on us. Um, but what I need to do now, or what I want to do now, is go out and do a little exploration. You know, we'll go out and do some, uh, some looting nearby. We're not going to take the boat today. Uh, instead, we are going to come down here, and I was looking on the map, and there's these, like, red dots that run along the top here. Those are all the wind turbines or the windmills that I see up there spinning around. But at the base, each one is like a building that you can explore. And uh, so, since we don't have a bike, you know, we're just going to kind of go on foot. We're going to go down this way, and uh, near the... What the hell is that? Oh, it's a bush. Near the end of this, uh, this road here, uh, where this fishing villages uh there's a trail i believe yeah there's a wooden turbine right there so we're gonna hit that one up uh we're not gonna go into that town right there instead we're gonna come up here through the woods and see if uh see what we can find at this location you know it's nearby my base it's not too far away um it's not a crazy big town i'm not gonna get capsized by waves so uh <laughs> or, or or bomb puppets and beepers and and all that stuff so anyway uh let's get up here and we're going to head to that first. Man, it's actually quite far away. And there's there's a whole string of them. But like, let's just head this way and, uh, and uh, I'll see you when we get there. Okay, we're coming up on that first wind turbine. Um, I ended up having to uh, strip off my stab-proof vest and my biker jacket. I was suffering from hyperthermia. Um, it's in recovery phase, but I was way overheating. Um, and I had to move all the stuff out of my jacket, unfortunately. Um, I'm going to try to put this back on. And because I just want the pockets, I want the space gone here. Plus, I want to use up the pockets, but I'll, I'll do that in a minute. I just want to make sure I don't get uh, overheated again. I do have the stab proof vest I took off. And here's the first. Uh, let me get my bat out in case we got any puppets. And this is the first turbine right here. And I think there's like all along the bottom, there's a trail that runs along the road, I think. Because I, th I think I've been here once before in a previous series. Yeah, there's some buildings and stuff. There may be some puppets, though. And uh, it's a good place to come by and check. Look, there's a car. Dude, there's a car right near my base I can fix up without having to go to a big town to do it. Oh, that's awesome. I got a car jack. I just don't have a lot of... It's got an engine in it. What do we have in this vehicle? Oh, look at that. Storage. Um, I should lock this up. It's got tires. It's got a seat. Dude, I only need a couple parts. I need a couple tires let me let me slap a lock on this vehicle this may become my new uh let me lock it all right we got a vehicle so let's do this let's open up the storage let's put the stab proof vest in there so i'm not carrying that around and let me get these items down into the uh i wish i need a bigger quiver but for right now this is what we're using um and that way i can get this stuff out of my inventory sweet we got us we got us a vehicle it looks like it's got an engine in it what the hell thought i heard a noise Anyway, let's get over here and check this area out. Yeah, this is this is kind of close to my base, so uh, this is a great 
vehicle location, you know, to start to 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 put together because, uh, you know, my, my base. Uh, my base is like right here, and that's the vehicle. Now, I did find another vehicle. I want to say it was uh, up in this area here, but I have to go to, through that town, you know, to kind of get to it or to fix it up. And there's a, I mean, there's a possibility of puppets here. But, you know, there being be like one or two. I'm not expecting, you know, I wouldn't expect there to be like eight puppets or a whole town full. But let's check inside. Of course, I freaking closed the door, open the wrong way. And... No, not much. This would be a nice place to put a base up. I wonder if you can get up... I wonder if you can get up top. You know, somehow. Alright, climb up there. Okay. There's, I don't know if you can climb that ladder or if you can even get through that doorway. But uh, that'd be kind of interesting. Let's close that up. Anything else around here? And that's just the first... Uh, that's the first place. So we got a car. We got a car uh, almost almost ready to go. <laughs> and as I said, it looks like it's got an engine in it already. I see a battery, an engine. I just need to get some tires and, you know, a seat. It looks like a driver's seat. And I could, I could probably swap these. T Let me see. That's enter. Yeah, I, I think if I got the jack up, I could probably get the um, um, seat moved to the other side. Possibly. Oh, crap. What the hell? What kind of puppet is that? Dude, it looks like more like a zombie than a... Let me go take care of this guy. I don't know if it's just her, but... Okay. She saw me. Use my baseball bat. I had a feeling there may be puppets over here in some of these places. Um, okay. Now, I gotta be careful, too. I, You know, I just got done playing Survive the Nights. So, I'm used to, like, running around and clubbing them... You know, clubbing the zombies, but uh, this one here, I may want to use my bow and, and take them out silently before they see me and potentially scream. But that that was one puppet right there. We got a whole string of these uh, wind turbines, and that one—that's the very first one. So that's where the car is at that first turbine. I'm surprised that, that was just one puppet right there. I said there may be more further up here. And the shadow cast from that giant spinning turbine is kind of freaking me out a little bit. <laughs> I just see the movement. I'm like, oh, what the heck is that? Okay, uh, we're at the next place. Let's search this. Oh, we got some food. <laughs> I'm not going to take it because I got canned tuna right there. And then mine's at 92%. And I've got plenty of food at my base, so that's not, a, that's not an issue. All right, let's check the inside of the next one here. Oh, we got some chests in this one. This would be a base. This would be a good place. Or better, a better place for a base. Because you got these chests. Uh, insulating rubber gloves. A box of nails. Eleven of them. Not bad. I still think you could, there's a potential of climbing up there. Again, uh, if you can actually get to the next floor above that. Or whether, you know, whether that metal partition. Oh, I hear a puppet. Whether that opens up or not is another question. But, uh... Let me just see if I can figure out where the hell this guy's making a noise. I heard up there he is right there. All right, let's get the bow. This is what we should have done before. Oh, and that black outline, that's for my freaking helmet that I'm wearing. That's the visor for my helmet. Okay, there's two. Three. All right. Yeah, that's from the visor. If I took the helmet off, that'll go away. And um, I may do that later, you know, take the helmet off. If it starts getting hot again, where I start overheating... I hear another puppet. Where am I hearing them from? I heard another one in the bushes. But I want my arrows back first. Okay. Let's see if we can search this guy really quick. Uh, nothing. All right, let's get up to the next place. <gasps> There's a puppet right there. All right, let's take care of this guy, too. Again, because if uh, if one of these guys screams, all these guys are going to come running. So we'll take care of them now so they don't. And that's the way we need to do it, nice and quietly. Okay, got two more arrows back. So far, so good. 
and you got nothing. Now we're not finding a whole lot. I mean, we found the vehicle, so that's a that's a that's a, that's a big bonus, you know, for us to find that. Oh, what the hell? Let me get up a little higher. I thought I saw a puppet in the bush. It's hard to see a little bit, especially when I have that sweat running down the screen. Yeah, I, it, it's kind of like movement, you know, and it catches my eye, but that's not it's not a puppet. It's just the the sweat. But anyway, let's get uh let's get back on the road over here. I'll move down a little closer to the next tower. And there's a bunch of these, you know, so we got tons of places to explore. They're just kind of spread out is the only problem. And again, there's puppets. So uh got to be cautious. That was uh this is only the third one. We got one, two, three, four, five more, it looks like, or four more after this. Okay, I'm not seeing any puppets here. Now, that first, that first tower that I went to, I don't think there was any puppets. Because usually when you go to a new place, and the way they fixed it, or the way they changed it, is uh, there's no, like, puppets just, like, standing around like there used to be. You know, it's like only after you've been there for a while, then they kind of show up. So, um, we may be okay and not seeing too many puppets when you get to these areas. I don't know. I'll say when we get to these areas, you may not see too many, but there's one right there. Okay, let's get the bow back out. Ooh, there's a military, and there's one right behind him, too. Okay. Okay, he's done. There's one behind him also I saw over here in the bushes right there. All right, but we're going to hold off on trying to get that dude. Let me get out of this stance. Damn, big piles of boxes. Ooh, we got trait. We got some cabbage seeds. Trainer's axe. I've, I've, I think I've seen that one once before. But it's it's an uncommon item. Let's let's take a look over here. Let's see where the puppet went to. Let's get up on top here and take a look around. Where'd you go, dude? I know you're in the bushes. There's a there's a puppet in the bushes over there. We gotta go back down that way. Alright. Man, this thing is That's a freaking creepy spinning blade. Not creepy, but terrifying because of the size of it. All right, where'd that other puppet go? I know there's one in the bushes over here. But well, we're going to get our uh, arrows. We'll search this military puppet. And he's got nothing that I want. And let's, uh, let's inch our way down this pathway with an eye into the bushes where that puppet was last seen. I, he could be standing in the middle of the bushes, and I just don't see him. He might have wandered, you know, into a thicker part of the bushes, and I just can't see him right now. But if he hears me or sees me, he'll come running at me. But I don't know. Right now, it looks like we're okay. All right, let me get the baseball bat back out. So, for a quick swing if I need to. And, okay. That's nice. Oh, we found a decent axe. And that that's a good weapon, too. That, uh, that axe. Matter of fact, let me do something. Let's take that and put that in number three s spot. So I can grab it out quickly if I need to as another weapon. I don't know where that other puppet went, but uh, I don't see him, so we'll leave him alone. And now we got the next tower right here. We got a couple cars that we can search. I don't see any puppets. I guess we need, like, two more tires for that other car. So if I can find, uh... If I can find a tire or two to take back, I'm, I may do something like that. Let's check this trash pile. Uh, lemon seeds and box of nails. I don't know why I picked up the cabbage seeds. Probably because they were decent shape. I just know one of these days I'm going to open up a door and there's going to be, like, four puppets standing in there. <laughs> I don't know. That'd be kind of neat, though, if, they, if that was the case. Oh, there's a freaking puppet right there. There's another one. Somebody heard me. All right, all right. Um, is he going to jump up here? Let me get my bow. I don't want him shooting or uh, screaming. Dude, what a freaking face. I got him right in the mouth. Let's get this one out of the way, too. Okay, was that it? I think that was it. 
I <laughs> shot that dude right in the face. Got a police uh, police body armor and helmet on. He's got like a face mask or something. Yeah, there's the mask is gone. His eyes are all dark. That's so creepy. Yep, he had a, a baklava. Baklava. All right, let's check this other dude. Get my other two arrows back. I was surprised. I guess because I hit him in the face, it killed him instantly. But normally those guys with those, you know, they take like two or three arrows to take down. But okay, well, that's the other tower gone. Let's get up here to the next one. We got at least three more. Oh, shoot. A freaking dude, I think he saw me. Oh, no, 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 no. Get the bow. Okay, I got to slow down here. I'm getting a little out of control. Ooh, it took that one out quick. Yeah, I'm starting to get a little too, uh, um, what's the word I'm looking for? A little too daring. I'm, I'm, I'm not taking my time like I should. Okay, where the hell did that puppy go? I thought he fell in the bushes over here. I want my arrow back. Um... Dude, where the hell's the puppet at? He gotta be in here in the bushes. Damn it. Oh, here he is. I just want to get my arrow. There we go. And I guess we'll search him while we're here. Oh, he's got some money. That's what I was waiting on. So I can fill up that slot again. Plus, we need to get some more money back. All right, let's move on. Uh, how's my arrows holding up down here? Okay, I've been using... I've been getting all my arrows back. Yeah, I've been using them from right here, those four. Okay. So, yeah, I haven't lost any arrows yet. Okay, three more... three, Four more turbines, dude. But that's all right, though. Like I said, uh... It's good exploration, good for finding loot... Well, not finding loot, but it's good places to find to look for loot. Okay, I don't see any puppets over here. Let's uh, check this pile of trash. A soda can. Let me go ahead and drink that. Just get that out of the way. What do I do with that can? Let me get rid of this uh, empty can. Need to carry that around with me. All right, got a few chests, nothing, and some fertilizer. We'll leave that alone. All right, there's a road right next to us, and it looks like there's one down there too. Where the hell does that go to? Oh, there's another road. Okay, all right. I heard a puppet. I'm hearing puppets. I heard another one. There's one over here in the bushes. I'll, I'll just go this way. We'll just go this way. Avoid him. I don't know that he heard me or saw me, but I don't see him chasing me. So we're just going to leave him alone. We're going to move on. Yeah, he was down that hill, I think. All right, let's get up here to the next turbine. Ooh, another car. Dude, this is another fixer-upper. But this is a truck. This would be better. But I've got already got a lock on the other one. Uh, what is this? What's this got on it? it? Looks like we're missing a battery. But the engine looks like it's here. It's got a tire. One tire. Not bad. I'd like, I would love to have this truck. I just can't... Uh, I don't have the stuff to fix it up. Uh, milk. We'll leave that milk in the trash pile alone. <laughs> uh, tomato seeds. We'll leave them alone. And that's empty. What the heck? Oh, it's an upside down car. I was like, dude, there's another freaking car over here. All right. Well, this one's got a little stuff, a little bit of stuff in it. 
Uh, pen. Nothing in there. There's another car down there. Let's check this one. There's a puppet right there. Holy crap. Oh, I need this knife. I need this knife. Let's take that right real quick. Uh, that guy looks like he's freaking having a mental breakdown right there. So we'll go ahead and get him out of his misery. Okay. Let's get the uh, club back out. Hopefully he's the only one in the area. Yeah, this knife. I want to take this knife because uh, the one that I was using had a uh, broken, and I just got re I got rid of it, and I didn't have a replacement for it. So there we go, right down there. Yeah, it, I, I I guess I had used it without thinking when I was base building, and it was like chopping up the branches and stuff. Here's another puppet down here. Let's get rid of him. Oh crap. Oh, crap. Oh, man. I don't know if I was missing them or they just weren't doing any. I think I was missing them with my arrows because I fired four and I got two back. And where? Let me guess. You put them up here. No. Nope. They put them in there. Okay, good, good. Let's see if I can grab any of the arrows that may have uh, missed and went flying. So they should be in a straight line right here. Here's one. Okay. We're only missing one arrow then. Go a little further. There we go. We got our arrows back. Awesome. I didn't even <laughs> I didn't even search that dude. I forgot all about it. Let's search him really quick. Because, you know, they could have money on him and stuff like that. Come on, dude. Nothing. Nothing that I want. Okay, we got a couple vehicles here to search before moving up to the next tower. And we only got a few of these towers left, so uh, it's a good place. Like I said, it's a good place to come by. It's not too busy. Uh, radio. No, we don't want any of this stuff. It's not too busy as far as, like, puppets and all, so it's it's a it's a good relaxing search area. Especially after getting killed in the last episode. This is like taking a break. <laughs> you know, from the, from the harder stuff, the harder areas. Um, all right, let's continue on up here. We'll follow the road all or follow this pathway to the towers. All right, a couple cars here. I'm um, not seeing any puppets. Let's check this car. Oh, is there, there's a lock. All right, let me take another lock. Since we did use one on the... Uh, I used one on my front door of my base, and I put one on that truck, so all my locks have been used up. So to find another one is good because I hate I don't I don't want to really craft those if I can help it. What is this oil filter? I'll just leave that there. And an empty bag. Okay, I don't see any puppets here. Well, graffiti all over the place. I just heard a noise. Let me close that door. Couple piles of trash. And some sea salt. <laughs> okay, where, I thought I heard a puppet. There's one right there. Okay, let's take care of him. Okay. Oh, crap. I didn't see that dude right there. <gasps> I missed him. Oh, crap. All right. <laughs> I, I, I missed quite a few shots right there on those puppets. So I got some arrows, arrow hunting to find. He's still, like, sitting up. <laughs> okay. There's one arrow back. Let's take the money. And you can keep your shirt. Let's find the other arrow over here. Maybe. There's one right there. There's one right here. All right, we got those arrows back. Let's find this other dude. I think we hit him twice, but I think we missed him once also. There he is. Okay, there's an arrow there. He may have one in him. You know, like embedded. Yep, there it is. 
I got a little bit of ammo, too. All right, let's get uh, these arrows need to be down here. And so does this one. And we'll take the one that's got two. Where's the one I had four? Yeah, these. Let me put those. We'll use these up first. That's the one that they're going to grab first. I still feel like we, we lost some arrows, potentially. Yeah, there's one right here. Okay. So I got three. Yeah, we're missing one arrow. Anyway, that's fine. You know, I had a feeling we were going to lose arrows eventually anyway, so it's not a big deal. All right, let's get up here. This should be the last tower or the last wind turbine. Okay, rubber band. Leave that alone. I'm not seeing any puppets. Ooh, got some, I thought we had some trash right there. There's one right there. I had a feeling it was going to be it was a hard hat. Right. These are the uh, wooden improvised arrows. Oh, and we took them out with one. All right, we'll go get him in a second. Yeah, we'll check these drawers or these uh, chests first. There we go. We got a toolbox. It's one of the things I was freaking needing. Small fishing pack. Let me take that as well. Let me try some fishing there where my base is, you know, at some point. All right, and we, I made an improvised fishing hook, too, uh, with the empty soda can that I had at my base. Uh, we got more garlic. I uh, don't really need that much. I mean, it's dirty, but I'll take it. Anything to help fight off an infection? Okay, what the heck? Oh, shoot. I thought I heard a freaking noise. All right, let's take care of this guy, too. Oh, crap. All right. I thought I saw one over here, but I couldn't tell if that was the wind blowing a tree. Yeah, I think it was a wind blowing a tree or another puppet. Anyway, let's get our arrows back. And let's go get the other one, too, so we can get our arrow back from that one. And you got nothing that I want. All right, we got a toolkit. At least now I can fix up my base, you know, like repair base elements. And uh, all right, where the hell did that puppet go? Where is the one that we shot? I should have went straight to it because now I can't freaking find him. What the hell? All right, I got to figure out where the hell my... Uh, where's that puppet I shot? Damn it. Oh, was that the last turbine? I think that was the last wind turbine. All right, we lost the wooden arrow. I can't find that puppet. I don't really remember where I shot him or where he fell. That's a log. Yeah, all right, we lost the puppet. Okay, no problem. Let's let's move on down here. I think there's a roadway that we can get to over here. Uh, let's take a look. Actually, it's over here. There's the road. Let's get on down here to the road, and we're going to follow this around to the next place that we can uh, go check out. And I don't want to get over overburdened. Uh, we're going to need to drink, and I think I'm going to eat some of that food. So let's, let's just get down on the roadway. Man, what the hell? My game keeps, like, lagging. Just a little, yeah, little spurts right there. What the hell? Sound like there's somebody freaking chasing me. All right. And let me, let me move down here further. I don't know why there's, like, a lag going on right now, but uh, making me nervous. Like the game's going to crash or something while I'm in the middle of a fight. And then my guy will be dead. Hey, what the heck? Look at the water. It's like two-toned. What the hell south? Oh, I can't. There's a wall. Oh, no, dude. I was always wondering what was further south of this island. Huh. Okay. All right, let me slow down a little bit. We don't need to wear yourself out. And I think I'm going to take... Let me take another drink. Let me take a drink of this uh, juice bottle. All right, looks like the lag kind of went away, so we may be all right. Let's get that back, and let's get this back. Yeah, there we go. And we'll get our thirst up a little bit. I do want to, I do want to eat some of that canned food, um, but I got to open that up first. So let's try doing that. Let me take that into my hands, 
Uh, let me take it in my hands. And let's, uh... Okay, hold on. I forgot you gotta do it a weird way. So let me, uh, let me take out that stone knife. Now I can open. And I'll, I'll use the stone knife. I don't care if that thing breaks. It's 11%. And let's put that back down here. Okay, the can is open. Let's go ahead and eat one portion. We don't want to eat all of it. I don't need to eat all of it, but this way I, my hunger was at 59, so now it's up to 60. It'll go up a little bit. This this way it'll it'll last a while longer before dropping below 50. I already got my thirst up to 65. All right, well, let's get over here. Uh, let's get down this road. Now, I think this road... Yeah, it takes me to the end. I don't know if there's something down here. You know, to the end of the road. I'm feeling warm again. I'm not a... Okay, I don't have any hyperthermia or nothing like that. And let me... Let me I want to see what's down here to the right. Because it looks like there may be a town or a little village. Or at least a couple houses. I don't want to run all the way to the end and have it be nothing down here. Um, I wish I could zoom in. It looks like there may be a red dot. But we'll go see what's at the end of this uh, road. Oh, it's a lighthouse. Okay, we got a lighthouse down here. All right, let's go check out the lighthouse. There's bound to be things I can search in here. This is the kind of time. This is the time when I need a vehicle. You know, I need a car. So yeah, we're gonna try to work on getting that car fixed. You know, next episode and beyond. I don't know. I don't think that'll be done next episode, but uh, we could definitely start on it. Start looking for tires, too. I may, I may take a trip to the other town where I saw the other vehicle and see if there's a tire on that one and then pull that off. There's another freaking boat down here. Oh, dude, you know what this means? This means I... Because I was going to have to walk all the way around to get to the other part over here. Because you see there's more turbines. There's turbines... You know, I searched all these turbines, but there's more that run all through here. I'm not going to go search all of them, but I thought I was going to have to run up to the road to get across. You know, because I don't think I could swim this with all the gear that I got. Now I can just jump in that boat and freaking sail it across. But let's check this place out first. See if we can find anything worthwhile in here. Hmm. I guess we'll start in here. Let's close that door up so we can work undisturbed. Okay, we got a brick. Oh, what the heck? Oh, that's gloves. We don't want those. Okay. Same stuff. I don't see any puppets. Let's get inside. I guess if we got it, we'll climb up a, up a ladder or something. Oh, I got driving gloves. All right, we got gloves on now. Uh, we got a leather backpack. What are, I think I can put stuff in the leather backpack and then put it in my inventory. <laughs> you got a skirt and a... That's a nice little outfit right there. Skirt and a blouse. Another large cooking pot. Damn. Oh, look outside the window. There's like a shipwreck. That's pretty freaking cool. Yeah, there's plenty of stuff in here to search. See what we can find. Nothing there. Oh, I forgot you can search the beds, too. Yeah. Find some money. A lot of rooms, too. A lot of lockers. I thought about making um, a lighthouse a base at one point, but there's so many freaking rooms and doors and windows. It's like, in order to secure it up, take a lot of work. Soap. I'll leave that alone. There's a pair of some pajama pants in the bathtub. <laughs> what the heck is that? Oh, it's an outhouse. All right. All right, let's get upstairs. Let's see what's up here on the next floor. Another locker. We can check this out. Yeah, a couple of lockers. Damn it. These things are empty. Now, I'm not going to go all the way up this tower. Crap. Because uh, I don't want to... I don't want to launch myself. And there's nothing really up there. You know, it's just a, another chance of me freaking dying. 
So we're gonna, not going to go all the way to the top. I just wanted to search down in here, see what we had. So we got a bathroom here, so why would you go to the outhouse? A raincoat. Let me take that. I don't think we have a raincoat on us anymore, or we lost it. Yeah, why would you come out here and use an outhouse when you got a bathroom right there? Then again, maybe that was outhouse was built before they had an indoor plumbing. I don't know. That's that room there. All right, I don't see any puppets here. Let's get down below, see if we can get this to the other shore. What I, what I wouldn't mind doing, but, you know, I don't know. You're not really allowed to have multiple vehicles of the same type. Um, but it wouldn't be bad if I had, like, this boat. And then also, like, on one shore and mine on, on the other one. Let's see how this one's doing. Yeah, 100% fuel and everything. Like, what I mean is, like, I've got a boat here, but if I sail this one, say, to, like, um, over here, then I could just cross the land and then take the boat. You know what I mean? Instead of having to take my boat and go all the way up and around, you know, I could take a vehicle, you know, and, and have a boat, like, over here. So, I don't know. But uh, let me look at the map again really quick. I don't need to go to the right. We wanted to come up this way. Yeah, this way I didn't have to worry about running down here to... Running down here to the bridge. I'll just take this boat over. Yeah, it's kind of neat. But I'm not going to claim this boat. I'm not going to throw a lock on it. I will use it. You know, and if, if, it's, if it's here next episode when I load in, I'll continue to use it. I just won't put a lock on it. That way if somebody else comes by, they can take the boat. The other one is mine. No, the one parked at my base. That one's locked. I got stuff in in the storage of that vehicle and I got a lock on my car that I'm going to claim and I've got that stab proof vest in there as well but let's come up this way we'll sail a little further what I really wanted to do but I didn't want to sail my boat around because it takes freaking forever I was going to go to that train yard and we actually have that coming up and there's another large city right here that we're going to go to right now. That's where we're going to head to. I wasn't going to go there because we didn't have a, you know, an easy way to get to it without, you know, either running there on foot or taking a boat all the way around. But now that we got this boat over here, let's take that over to this city. And then next episode, we're going to try to loot this city or try to search some of the buildings in here before we head back. And like I said, if I lose the boat, that's not a big deal. Oh, oh, here we go with the freaking waves again. Let's see, where are we at? In the... We actually got quite a ways. There's the town. All right, not too far. Not too far away. It looks like the wind... The wind whenever the wind picks up, that's when I have this issue. With this freaking boat in the waves. Uh, we'll just hug the shoreline. Because that water does look deep over there. And if the boat capsizes and I'm, I'm overburdened, you know, like where I can't swim, I may be able to walk... Uh, out of the water to the shoreline before I drown. Because <laughs> I don't want to take all my crap off and have it drop to the bottom because then I'm making, I'm making dives back and forth you know, to get that stuff. But yeah, this is, this is awesome. We can come up right here to this... Because uh, I was going to go to the train yard you know, and search this area. That's a big area. That's got mechs in there. There's no mechs in this place, but it's huge. Which means there's going to be puppets galore. Well, let's let's get over here. We're gonna uh, we're not gonna get too close to the place before getting out of the boat. But you know what? Actually, let me try something. Let me try something that I wanted to try the last couple episodes, and we just didn't have the opportunity. I wanted to fire my shotgun and see if I can get the puppets to come running, and then throw themselves into the water and drown. We did that once at the gas station, at the fish factory, but I didn't see a whole lot of puppets. It was just those two. Here may be a little bit different. I was gonna, I was gonna like park it here and walk in on foot, you know, for next episode. But maybe I can pull right up to this freaking shore coastline here, and then right in the middle, we'll find a big building with some puppets, and we'll get him to come after us. Yeah, let's try that. Dude, look at all the freaking buildings. This is like a mini uh, Sambora city right here. What the heck? Oh, that was a rock underwater. All right, we got a coastline. We got it looks like a, a what do they call them? This little port here where they break the waves. Uh, see, I don't see any puppets. 
It doesn't mean they're there or not there. Let me do this. Let me go out a little further in case there are puppets nearby. And they would be under the water. Let me get up, get the boat. See, now I'm standing. Oh, crap. I'm standing in the boat with this thing swaying back and forth. Anybody? Damn, see, I don't like this. Look at this thing. All right, I don't see any puppets coming. Dude, I can't freaking... I can't get... There we go. I couldn't get him to freaking sit down. Alright, this is what we're gonna do. Because of these waves are crashing around me, you know, making my boat bounce up and down, make me nervous. I don't want to really stand up in the boat. But we're gonna come over here. It looks like there's a ship upside down blocking the harbor entrance. Ooh. That's alright though. We're gonna come right inside here. I'm going to find a place where we can get off easily. Here we go. You know what? That's not a good spot because I would be trapped right there. On that side. Uh, here's a here's a place over here. With a ladder. You know, with the stairway. The stairs going up. Uh, I want to find another place like that. That's not right at the freaking entrance. Yeah, let's go over here a little further. Yeah, that's a, this a big freaking town here. Here we go. I see one over here. That'll kind of wraps around. Yeah, we're kind of close to the shore, but this is fine. Like I said, uh, I'm not going to claim this boat. I don't think there's anything in it anyway. No. But we're going to park it right there. And see what's around. You know, I think I've been here once before. No, 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 no. That was over. That was over here. I think. Oh, maybe it was. No, I don't know. Maybe it was here. Yeah, because I think I came across this bridge and then I came down this way, and we were right over there. I think that was a previous series, though. Possibly, maybe not. It may have been this one. But we'll leave the boat right there. Yeah, I have been here. Okay. You know, fairly recently. And there was puppets and stuff. Okay, but we're going to park the boat right there. Is that another freaking boat? Hold on. No, that looks like a boat. A boat. You know, that'd be awesome if you can get, like, one of these one of these boat racks, you know, that you can attach to your vehicle. And then I can put my boat on it, drive that boat, like, across the freaking island, and put it, like, up in here in this lake. Um, other than, you know, above the dam. I'd have a boat in there. But that'd be cool if you could do that. You know, get a boat rack. All right. Anyway, I think we're going to wrap the episode up right here. I'm just going to... I'm going to log out right here. Um, I do want to thank you for taking the time to watch. Man, there's a bit of a lag going on. So, yeah, we, we, need, to, we need to exit out of here before something happens. But uh, anyway, let me wrap it up here. Thank you so much for watching. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next week.